school and track yes, and sir. all that stuff I have currently going on, which is an excuse for my inconsistent schedule. When was the last tier list video? I'm gonna go down, down. Oh god. Oh shit. Uh, it's literally been almost three months. What's today's date? Oh god. Um, um, oh, uh, totally did not shoot up to school baby. today. I, I, I'm a, uh, I'm a Alright, what's going on guys? The Forest Champion plays here, and welcome back to another video, and yeah, welcome back to another face cam video. We are here with yet another tier list. Here we're gonna originally do a cog tier list. I'm saving that for another time. But we're also we're gonna do a Fortnite season tier list. We had to save for another time. Nickelodeon tier list. You get the whole picture, I'm not gonna <laughs> explain it. But yeah, we are making another tier list here today, guys. Not just any other tier list, but we are making a cartoon network tier list i've been back and forth to maybe up to eighth grade cartoon network is basically all i watch basically there's a lot of shows not only from cartoon network from also from nick and disney channel that i watch growing up as well and i also watched sprout pbs kids too when i was younger make more tier lists yes, like sir. this because yes, i want to show you guys how goaded my childhood yes, was sir. it will be a nickelodeon tier list disney channel tier list pbs kids maybe sprout tier list eventually this cartoon network tier list does well or it, it might just be f1 Call of Duty and then some, but you know, it's coming, it's coming, okay? But, anyways, about to make this tier list, you guys cool and down with that. Everybody sit back, relax, get ready, cause here we go. Man, this tier list is about to be something. I can already tell by the list of shows here, this tier list is about to be built different. You know, we know how this goes. We got Peak Fiction, the goat, made my childhood yes, so much better, awesome, yes, pretty yes, good, yes, decent. Yes. And then we got the low tiers, mid, good, not bad, trash. I regret watching that show, horseshit ice cream with piss on top. Probably two remakes that's on this tier list, but I'm not gonna say who yet. Of course, haven't watched, don't remember. Haven't watched is like I heard of it, don't remember. It's like I don't remember watching it ever. Uh, Blade Blade. Blade Blade is pretty good. I think I saw like 20 episodes. Blade Blade, but I never really had much Blade Blade toys. We're not even 20 seconds into this list. Total Drama. Total Drama series. Come on. Come on. A masterpiece! Facts, facts. And I already know there's gonna be some of those fuckers that like. Oh, Redonculus Race was trash! No, it wasn't, nigga! Redonculus Race, probably the most underrated season of Total Drama. Peak fucking fiction. No discussion whatsoever, okay? We got my nigga Courage. Courage was awesome. I think I was like five or six when I saw my first episode of Courage. Like, man, I forgot the old guy. Courage the Carly Dog, of course, made many of our childhood. And you know, it's goaded. Grim and the Evil. Grim and Evil was pretty good. Ben 10 Alien Force. Ooh. Ooh. Holy shit. Ooh. Ben 10 Alien Force was probably my favorite Ben 10 ever. I also like Omniverse as well, so. Ooh. I'm a bit Ben 10 Alien Force. I'd awesome. I think it had yes, more sir. of like a serious yes, tone on like, you know, the earlier yes, Ben 10 sir. shows. Of course, classic Ben 10. Ooh. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit. Ooh. Now, a lot of you are probably are going to unsubscribe from me. No! 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 I said it. I said it. I do not care what anybody says, bro. You cannot be serious if you hate Teen Titans Go. You cannot be serious. Teen Titans Go. Probably the most funniest show ever, bro. And I already know there's going to be people in the comments section. So they should have just continued the original Teen Titans, which I get, by the way. Like, name one bad Teen Titans Go episode. Oh, wait. It was super funny whatsoever and never missed. If it weren't for Teen Titans Go, none of us would have heard of this banger that is centered on Google right now. If you don't like Teen Titans Go, I'm sorry. Go fuck yourself. MRI Jack. MRI Jack. You, we, we, we know this. He peeks in the world, by the way. So binge watch worthy, bro. MRI Jack was probably the first binges I did like, three, four years ago. I wouldn't know because Goblin can confirm this. Over the Wall Garden. Haven't watched. Don't remember it. Never heard of it in the first place. Ah, OG Powerpuff Girls. Awesome. Was such a classic, even though I didn't really watch it that much because, you know, again, with the sexist shit of throwing you as a child back in the day, which I totally didn't give a fuck about. I always found Powerpuff Girls, the OG one, very entertaining as well. Sunny Bridges. I want to tell myself I seen it. Don't 
Oh, oh total spies. I remembered it. Oh. Uh, <laughs> nope. <laughs> nope. Ed, Ed, and Eddie. Oh, greatest yes, trio yes, of yes, all yes, of humanity. Yes, if you don't yes, think Ed, sir. Ed, and Eddie is peak fiction, I'm telling you right now, go to rehab, bro. Secret Mountain for awesome? Um, okay, I don't remember this show either. I, I do remember the Transformer show. Yes, sir. Your boy loved Transformers, bro. No matter what it was. We Bear Bears. We Bear Bears is a classic. Do they still make episodes? I, I forgot. Hey, what? Well, no. no Oh, fucking they canceled it no, why would y'all no, cancel a no, masterpiece no. they canceled rebirth bears i never knew that it's 2022 i'm just now realizing it got canceled but other than that rebirth bears definitely one of the best shows to come yes, out within sir. the past few years it's 2016 to be honest and tam Oniverse. definitely on the same level as ben 10 alien force oh Johnny test. Despite the rip crack sound effects that constantly go off every single fucking second. Do I like the new revival Johnny test? Fuck no, baby. Okay, we got Mixel. I wasn't oh, really shit. a fan of this show, but I think the show was pretty decent. Billy and Mandy, no discussion needed. Man, we're getting a lot of peaks in here. Holy shit. Camp Laszlo. Camp Laszlo was pretty good. Definitely not in my top 20, but it was a pretty good show. Oh, oh, oh it's my nigga. It's the man, the myth of legend himself. Uncle Grandpa, bro. Peak. 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 Just Isn't like Teen Titans Go, goes. name one bad Uncle Grandpa episode. Dope. TikTok. Oh, oh wait, it's too up, late. Shut Is it Craig in the Creek? I actually saw a couple episodes. I think it's good, honestly. Yes. It's definitely one of the better Cartoon Network shows that came. I mean, then again, I haven't really watched anything from oh, Nick, shit. Cartoon Network, and Disney Channel since game near 2018. But you know, I'm interested in watching it a lot more. Choppy Saki. Um, don't remember this. Ah, Adventure Time. Probably the most overrated Cartoon Network show of all time. Still a very great show. Say not my favorite Cartoon Network show. I mean, it's everybody's favorite. Most popular and the most liked show. It's, a, it's not always the best for me, in my opinion. I really think it's awesome, but it's not peak. A regular show, on the other hand. Come on. Come on. Who in the hell would disagree? Almost every single thing on a regular show was funny. Regular show, the perfect show that we need. Nothing will top regular show. Bro. Perfect humor, perfect amount of plot, a very satisfying ending. One of the greatest shows ever. Facts, facts. Uh, it is Blade Blade. Dude. What is this show? Akugan. Okay, Blade Blade. You go to pretty good. Okay. Yu Gi Oh! Yu Gi Oh! is awesome. Yu Gi Oh! is a certified anime classic. Ben 10 Ultimate Alien. Definitely not my favorite. But it's pretty good. I think a lot of people do not like Ultimate Alien, and you know, I totally understand. Ultimate Alien are decent. Ooh, Clarence. Clarence used to piss me off. Oh no, it's just that show just used to piss me the hell off. Clarence himself is funny. It's Jeffrey in that in that ball kit that mostly is so unbelievably stupid. Like it literally makes my head hurt and it makes my blood boil. Jim Clarence just makes me lose all kinds of brain cells. How and chicken. Do I remember the show? Uh nah, no, I don't think so. Generator Rex. Do you remember seeing maybe our episode two? And it, it, it was decent. Number 108. Pretty good. I do remember that show. Cat Casper. Casper is my nigga. Pokemon. Super, super overrated. Never really found it that entertaining, especially it literally has as much episode as One Piece. Watching it entirely is just so overrated to hell and back. Uh, <laughs> uh, I am making a Star Wars tier list soon. Star Wars The Clone Wars. Come on, bro. The greatest animated show of all time. No discussion whatsoever. Everything yes, about Clone Wars yes, is perfect. Yes, it's just, it's just it. Film with yes, this show, sir. bro. Hit, hit. Hit. In nothing the even off the season miss. seven in the missed okay oh, crypto is this superman's dog actually i don't remember watching looney tunes looney tunes looney tunes is peak come on matter of fact where's where's tom and jerry tom and jerry can also go up there come on have watched looney tunes or tom and jerry your childhood is complete ass water this. what the fuck is this uh i haven't watched this show but this show looks absolutely dog shit. kids next door this is the most thing that has been been in peak in the single tier list ever. I'm not gonna joke. Kids Next Door. And of course, it's a classic just like Billy and Mindy. Vanilla Ben 10. Peak. <laughs> I saved myself. Ah, Johnny Bravo. Uh, I didn't watch it that much, but it's, it's a classic. Don't remember watching this show. Oh, Flapjack. 
Freddy Flapjack was pretty decent, I won't lie. I don't have the most memories of that show, but I think it was pretty fine. Foster's Home and Imaginary Friend, definitely a classic in my opinion. Chowder! <laughs> Who doesn't think Chowder is gonna? I would say it's, t it's top 5 Cartoon Network of all time. If not top 5, definitely top 10. I can't remember this show. This show is so familiar. Mighty Magic Swords. I have not heard of that name in such a long time. This show was awesome. This show was good. And this show was pretty damn good. I won't lie. I remember who she is now. She gotta die. She got these legs. Oh, she got a bad. But 17. Peak, bro. 17. One of those shows you could just 100% just chill out to. Bro. It's definitely super relatable. My gym partner is a monkey. This show was funny as fuck. I ain't gonna cap. <laughs> a few episodes just, man. I mean, I just remember laughing my ass off. Oh, there it is. There it is. Ben 10 Revival. Horse shit ice cream with piss on top. I just mentioned it a few minutes ago and I will mention it again. The new Ben 10, absolutely dog shit, okay? The writing is too peck of ass, so boring, and the animation is so subpar. The fucked up thing about it? I was actually hyped for the revival, probably one of the worst shows I ever seen. Apple and Onion. I do remember I didn't like it that much. You know, while we're turning to Cartoon Network back in 2018, one of the first things I've seen is Apple and Onion. I never found it to be entertaining. Okay, KO though. Okay, KO's a banger. Definitely a show that has come out within the past couple years. I don't think there was one bad episode, especially Cartoon Network nowadays. Scooby Doo put Scooby and the gang up there in peak because, you know, remember what's new Scooby Doo? That is the best version of Scooby Doo, and that will not be up for discussion. If it's Squirrel Boy, I don't remember this shit. The new Powerpuff Girls. This shit is horseshit. Get rid of this cringe in front of my face. Same for the Ben 10 revival. Entire show is super subpar and it's so, so unbearable. Batman the Brave? Oh, it is Batman the Brave. Oh. If this was a picture of Justice League Unlimited, Justice League Unlimited will go in peak. No fucking question. Batman in the Batcave. Decent show. I won't lie. It's it's pretty decent. And I like a lot of Batman shows and movies too. This show. That one wasn't the worst. It's also not meant to me for some reason. Almost naked animals. Pretty. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. So cursed to me, in my opinion. Oh, Amazing Real Gumball. Always has been funny. One of the best shows. One of my favorite shows of all time. It is a masterpiece, people. Show right here is in my top five. One of the greatest shows to ever roam this earth. No one will top the duo of Gumball and Darwin. Anybody says. Steven Universe. Awesome show. Very overrated by everybody but you know i mean yeah it's not the best show in the world but it's fire it's fire bro Sembonic titan i don't remember that show we got the og teen titans and that is going to go to peak teen titans go teen original teen titans i love them both okay i just love them both og teen titans is funny but it's more on the serious side and of course teen titans go it's also funny just on the less serious side tier list complete but anyways that's gonna do it for today's tier list video hey, hey let me know what you guys think what's your favorite cartoon network show Shut the fuck up. like what's your current favorite cartoon network that's out right now obviously i have not watched cartoon network in a very good while when i watch tv i mainly watch youtube or twitch so let me know what you guys think if you guys want more tier list videos here in the future i know what to do be sure to hit that like button comment and subscribe with all notifications on if you're new here help me reach 1,000 subscribers at the end of this year if not definitely me next year before I graduate high school I'm confident I'll make it to 15 mil 1 million subscribers one day now, I'm also pretty sure that 90% of you who are watching this video right now aren't subscribed to the channel so yeah I encourage you to subscribe 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 and yeah this is your boy Tavor Chevy Play Sam peace out stay safe stay positive my friends peace